So you've got the plates for outside that, you, that you're working on that building that you made, right? This is, represents a two by four rafter, two by four rafter. This is the center line. So our span is four feet, our run is two feet. This is a unit of run, up five, in 12. That's how we get this. Um, the diagonal of that is 13 inches. So if I take two units at 13 inches, the line length of my rafter, the outside, the line length of the rafter, outside of the building, center, 13, two times is 26. If you come over, you can see here, you come in, 13 is one, it lines up with that one, and then 26 lines up with that one. And however many units you're going in, you just keep doing that, and that gives you the length of your rafter. All right, and notice it's, it's, it's elevated off this. If I set here five, up five, in 12 to the top of the rafter, reading the same line, it gives me this angle for our fascia cut. Does that make sense? You see yeah. what I've done? I've taken this tool, five and 12, slide it down to the rafter, five and 12. If I want to read the inside of the square, <laughs> I would have to put it out here like this, five and 12, and that gives us that line. To get this cut, I can go under, flip it this way, and go 12 and five on the same line. So come in here, put the point up here at five, come down, go slide over to 12, same side of the square, and that gives us this cut right here. So that's what you guys are gonna attempt to do now, is to cut, lay out and cut four of these, and we'll bring it out and see if we can put it on the building. All right, there we go. Nice job, guys.